the evening. Or just build an audience. <sighs> and I'm sorry I'm late by 15 minutes. Again, it's just like before. If you share the video and like the status, um, you're in the chance to win my competition. These are messaging the page asking when I'm coming online. I'm online now, guys. Hi, Marianne. Um, so if you like and um, like and share the live feeds, then someone can win the competition at the end for an online reading. Hi Jenna, hi David, hi Pauline. Oh, you're all joining us now. You're sharing the video. I appreciate that. Thank you. Um, and again, I want to give you some messages, but I have not stopped all day. I've been out doing readings all day. I'm literally in the door 10 minutes ago. So I've literally came from doing that to doing this. Hi Nicola, see you back at work soon. Um, hi Carmen. We've got some lovely validations on the private mail from some of the girls that had had their readings on the video last week. So I do thank you. I've not got your names at hand. I am not organised tonight, but I do thank you very much for all your validations. Odds Wiley, hi Chrissy, did you get a chance to have a look at the pics and videos I sent you last week? Yes, I did, but I will come back to you. I'll come back to you tomorrow. Okay, I had a wee nosy, um, but I'll come straight back to you tomorrow. Odds with that, but thank you. I do appreciate that. Oh, you're all coming in quick and fast. Hi, Gemma. So you can leave your messages at the bottom. Um, how was the holiday? Yes, the holiday was great. Thank you. Didn't really want to come home. Looking good. Glad you had a nice holiday. Thank Elsie Watts. Um, do you have anything for me? Elsie, yes, I do. Keep doing what you're doing, missus. I just feel like saying there's a chap at the door coming for you and it's to do with a recorded delivery. Some sort of later, but it's good news, not bad news, Elsie. If you can validate, let me know. Um, who else have we got? Cheryl Mitchell, hi, I messaged last week since my reading. I keep seeing 1111, what does this mean? 1111 11, 11, 11 is the angel numbers. So when you start seeing them, that spirit telling you whatever you're asking for, I'm seeing all the love hearts, whatever you're asking for is, um, it's coming to you and have a wee bit more faith in spirit. Who else have we got? Hi, Monique. Hi, Emma. Oh, you are all lovely. Um... So again, if you like and share the video, we will pick a winner at the end, all right, for the free online reading. All the other girls who've had won the online readings, they've had their readings now, um, and they've left some reviews on the page, so you can have a wee nosy as well. Um, I did some online readings yesterday and on Saturday, and it was lovely speaking with you, so you were all fab. I'm not going to be on too long tonight, I'm so sorry guys, but I am done in, absolutely done in, and I've not had my dinner, I'm starving. Right, let's get some messages on the go, so just leave your wee comment at the bottom, but if you like and share the video, we'll pick a winner at the end, alright? Who have we got tonight? Hi Lynn, that's admin's mum. Um, Kim Matthews, glad you had a good holiday, I'm on holiday just now. Oh Kim, I hope you're having a lovely time. Um, I'm kind of glad to be back just for normality. Uh, who else have we got? Oh, these are coming through. David Anderson, anything for me tonight, Christy? <coughs> David, I feel like saying to you, you're debating over a decision regarding a property or a house or something. But there just seems to be a big decision, but you keep backtracking. You have to be a bit more decisive. Um, you seem to be putting out to the universe you're not in sync with your mind and what your body's telling you to do. What I feel like saying, David, be a bit more decisive, but be aware of a man with dark hair, and I get the name Paul. Let me know if you can validate and we can go on, all right? I hope you like that. Elsie Watts, thanks. Oh my God, it came today. It's a gift from my partner. So you've got your recorded delivery. How strange is that? Um, brilliant, Elsie. Nothing else to worry about. Just go with the flow. Read the secret. Stay positive. Gemma Smith, holidays done you good. Do you think? <laughs> I'm more shattered from looking home. No, I've just not stopped, but thank you, yes. I feel more refreshed, or a little. Right, who else have we got here? Lisa Macy, I hope I'm saying that right, Lisa. Anything for me? Hmm. Lisa, I feel like saying to you that there's just someone around you at the moment that's either having relationship problems, could be closer to home, but what I want to say to you is that you have to go with your gut instinct. There's more positivity needed, and I also see a tap that's bursted, it's dripping. 
Let me know if you can validate me and go on, Lisa, okay? Again, I'm behind with the comments. Hi, Sharon. Um, liked and shared. Thanks, guys. So if you like and share the video, then there'll be a winner at the end for an online reading, okay? Um, and can I just say in this video, just always make sure it's live. We get a lot of comments. Um and a few days afterwards um, and it's four or five and it's because people think we're still live so double check it's not so we are live at the moment um, Gemma Smith did I make the right move yes Gemma but I feel like the more that you think about it you're going to make yourself think it's a bad move it's not you need to embrace new changes and new challenges and have a wee bit more faith in it I also feel like saying there's a woman in spirit she wore a penis just tell me about your little girl and dancing in her hair. Oh, if you can validate, let me know, Gemma. Um, who else have we got? Liz Hillary would love a message from my brother. Liz, I feel like saying to you that your brother's telling me about a piece of jewellery. I think it's a watch, but also I want to say to you, he is talking about the garden or the brick. And I also want to say that there's news coming for you as well regarding someone's house move or someone coming overseas. Liz, if you can validate, let me know, okay? Thank you. Oh, these are all lovely. Your comments are brilliant. Again, like and share the video. I've got to keep remembering to do this. Like and share the video, and then we'll pick an online winner at the end. These are also lovely, your comments. Someone's saying about the live videos. I know it's been a while. Um, over a week. Oh, admin's joined, finally. Thanks, Eva. Um, <coughs> I've just not had the time. As I said before, I can't commit to them. I will do them any time that I can. All right, you've got my word, guys, and I appreciate all your support on the page. Let's get to some of these comments now. Some people are writing, they think they're invisible because they're not getting a reading. The amount of comments that come onto these videos, I'm not missing these out on purpose, guys. I go to who I'm drawn to, okay? Right. Jamie Lee Marus Robertson. Hi, Christy. Watch all the time. Anything for me tonight. Hope you had a nice wee holiday, missus. I did indeed, Jamie Lee. Thank you. Um, I keep seeing a wee baby in spirit for you. Or someone close to you, but I also see a child in a cot that's very spiritual. And I want to see that there's either the dog on your stairs or you've got a hunch that there's something on your stairs. It's not anything untoward. I just feel you need to acknowledge it. I feel there's a little bit of child play in your house at the moment. If you can validate, Jamie Lee, that'd be great. Thank you. Who else have we got? Julie Moody Wilson, hi my hubby is at a dead end just now, any news? The tables are turning but I feel that his attitude is keeping them down and when your attitude's down, nothing's going to come to you, there's no positivity, you, you have to be open minded and open to receiving. Um, I want to say that he feels a bit sunken at the moment but I feel there's a woman in spirit saying, he's, come on you know what to do, you're better than that. She's also given me the name, it's either Liz or Betty, so I'm going to say Elizabeth, but let me know if you can validate. Um, I know you've all been waiting in this video. <laughs> Gemma Smith, oh my god, spot on. Is she okay? Of course she is, Gemma. I'm glad you could validate that as well. She's fine. You need to slow your mind down a wee bit, Gemma. It's going too much, you're a bit... It goes too quick sometimes, um, and it's giving you a lot of anxiety. I hope you can relate to that. Um, thanks, Gemma, and I'm glad you validated. Liz Hillary, yes, that's so correct. Thanks for the validation as well. Um, yep. Yeah. I want to say to you, Liz Hillary, as well, I feel someone with dark hair can be quite overpowering, a woman. Um, don't succumb into that. Okay, put a wee bit more fight in there, Liz. I hope you can relate to that. So we go up. Marianne Bannon, am I on the right track to be to begin in sync? 
Yes, I think you're on the right track, Marianne. I feel you let your mind get the better of you sometimes, and I feel you need to rise above that yourself. You're too judgmental on yourself. Always remember this, we're always our own worst critics. We'll always bring ourselves down before someone else does, and that attracts us to bring other people down as well. So just be aware, but I feel, yes, you are on the right track. The worst is over. I feel that you've emotionally got yourself into tow, Marianne. All right, if you can validate, let me know. Elizabeth Kyle, love a message from my uncle. He's telling me about there's a holiday or you're not you're meant to go somewhere but you're debating not to go. And also an anniversary. I feel like saying you have to get yourself out a wee bit more. I feel like you're hermiting a little or someone as close to you and close to your uncle. That's not you, he's saying. I feel to say that you're worried that this man's not at peace. I feel he's very much at peace. But what I want to say is it's his, whether it's his anniversary around the death, there's too much emphasis on the negative. We need more positive. All right, Elizabeth, if you can validate, let me know. I'm a bit behind with the comments. Hi, Uncle Billy. Lauren McAnally. <laughs> Christy, I think I share my house with a spirit. We all share our house with spirits. They're all good. Put it this way, if you see something moving in your house, like this pen fires across the kitchen or whatever, that's when you need to worry. That's a poltergeist building up. So I would be very concerned like when I came back fed and revolt, saying they watched my videos, know that I had a bit of <laughs> activity. Um, but I wasn't concerned because nothing moved as such. The minute things start moving in your house and you see it, that's the only time you should ever be concerned because that's a poltergeist starting to build something up in itself. Other than that, you'll always feel spirit with you. If you remember, and sometimes some of you message me after it, there's always be orbs at this side. It's everywhere. As long as you acknowledge it and you're... The poltergeist feed off fear. So it's not worth talking about for that reason. Hi, Colette, you're on. Could you let your husband know, Colette, if you could validate? <laughs> All your messages are lovely. Again, if you like and share the video, we're doing a competition and someone will win at the end for a free online reading. David Anderson, my partner and I keep talking about moving out but haven't done anything about it. Don't know anyone called Paul. I'll watch out for him. Watch out for that. I think it's more to do with business, David, with the Paul thing. <coughs> I feel you're going to make a decision on moving in November. And I feel someone's seen a new build. Um, but sorry, what someone's saying a new build, but the other person doesn't seem to be so keen. You will buy a new build. Thanks, David. Um, okay, another wee validation. Guys, if you're messaging the page for appointments, all admin are on the page at the moment, okay? So we'll not be replying. We don't have any appointments until the end of... Well, we're booked up till the end of August. I don't have anything for September at the moment. We will put them on the page. It's not going to change until we say, okay, September dates won't be out until middle of July, end of July now. All right, Jamie Lee. My son is the only child I can think of. Um, Christy, he's 10 weeks old. He stares at certain corners of my living room and finds it amusing and you can't break his focus. Any clue why? He's very spiritual, Jamie Lee. That's what I'd said to you in the first reading there for that reading. I feel he's fixating on the same part. It's either a grandfather, but it's a male spirit. Very proud of him. And they're talking about he's got this man's nose. If you can relate, great. Loving the tan. Thanks. Do you think I don't think I got that great a tan this year? Thanks, so. Gemma Smith, you need to book a reading. As I said, we're booked up just now, but as soon as the dates come up, we'll put them up for you. It's all right. Um... Stephen Murray. Oh, that's a big long one, but I'm going to read this out. Hi, Christy, it's Stephen Murray here. I spoke to you yesterday, so you did. Just wanted to say thank you again, and I'm feeling more positive thanks to you. My friend Ashley Finnegan would love a reading tonight as she was blown away by your accuracy in my reading. Hope you're well. So, Stephen, get her to comment, and if I find her name, I'll do it that way. I find it harder to read if I can't... <coughs> Not that I have got time to get into your profiles. 
Um, but on the video, it's easy to do it that way because it's the message that matters. Stephen, I loved reading for you and I'm so glad that you're staying positive. You know what you have to do and you know when I'm out if you need anything. All right, you take care. Uh, uh, who else have we got? Hi, Anne. I'm sure you're in Florida just now. Marianne, you're bang on. Thanks for all the validations. Marianne, just remember what I said. More positivity. My eyesight's terrible tonight. It was really bad. Hi, David Allen. Not spoken a while. Hope you're well. <coughs> Lauren McAnally. I think it's something or someone. Lovely. I think it is. I think you're spoken. Nothing to fear, Lauren. Nothing to fear at all. David Anderson, thank you. I'm glad. I'm getting there now. Steve Mack, I feel like I'm reading an important message from my gran. Oh, you are, but I don't know if you're going to like it. You need to pull your socks up. You know what you need to do. You need to be braver and you need to be stronger and you need to be a lot more decisive. I also feel that there's something to do with someone's red front door. I don't know why I'm getting that. I don't know if it was grand, but she's also telling me Someone keeps changing their hair colour and I feel it's either your sister or a partner, but I feel it's more family orientated. You can let me know. Elizabeth Kyle, spot on. Anniversary coming up and I've started getting out more. Thanks for that message, Christy. Elizabeth, that's what to do. We can all hear it in the house, but nobody really cares. And I don't mean it in a bad way, but everyone's life is so busy that sometimes a lot of people fly under the radar. That's why sometimes it's the cry for help that you need. You just need to speak to someone or sometimes it's easier to speak to a stranger. I find in my reading, she's all love. You would tell me your bank pin numbers. You really would. And I find it so strange when you've never met me, but you find it easier to consult on the problem with me rather than a family or friend. That makes me happy. I feel honoured. But a problem shared and everything. So if anyone's not feeling their shell or feeling a bit down and they're writing on the video and I'm just not getting to for a message, don't be disheartened. Look back in all the feeds that I put on the page, not just the videos, but all the positive things. They're the things that are there to uplift you. Um, anything I put on the page is something that's maybe worked for me in the past, and that's why I'm putting it onto yourselves. Uh, right. Who else have we got? Hmm. I'm loving all these love hearts. Thank guys. Again, if you can like and share the video, the live video, then you may win the online competition at the end. Right, okay, Jamie Lee. Yeah, tags baby on. It's always the same corner. And yeah, my great granddad is the only one in spirit I can think of. Could be my granddad from my mum's side though, but never met him as he passed before I was born. I feel it's the grandfather from your mum's side that you never met. A lot of people say to me in readings, yeah, but I never met them. Yeah, but you wouldn't be here if it wasn't for them. So they're very well connected to you. And just because you didn't meet them, they know who you are. All right, Jamie Lee. Who else have we got? I'm going to give it another five minutes and then I'm going to have to leave you tonight. Because I thought I'd have enough. David Allen, I'm better. Um, I've been better, but I'm getting there. Hope you're okay too. I'm great, David. David, um... Things are looking up. You just had a bit of a slump, I feel. And it's not like you. Any messages you've sent me, you've always been very upbeat. There's, you've sent me Reiki at times. Um, be a bit more upbeat. And you know it's exhausting to be happy, but it'll be pay off in the long run. All right, David? Right, who else have we got before we go? Right, Marianne Bannon, thanks again. By the way, I really needed that. You've been spot on. I'm so glad. Ashley Finnegan, hi Christy, it's Ashley Finnegan here. You've done a reading for Stephen Murray, yes I did. Um, really love for you to have something for me. Oh Ashley, I feel there's a big career choice coming up for you. You're debating over job just now. I also want to say that you are... It's something to do with a car. You think they're changing your car or are you waiting for finances to change to do with the car? There's a woman in spirit as well and she's telling me about you either you save curly hair or you keep making your hair curly, but she loves it. It changes the shape of your face. She's telling me. Let me know and we'll see. Thank you. Um, oh, these are also lovely comments. Sammy Graham, I sent a validation through mail. Thank you so much for giving me hope. Anything new? Sammy, I just read your validation before I come on the page quickly. I'm so glad. I don't feel you need anything else. Now what I feel like saying is go with the flow and enjoy it. Because you've got nothing to worry about. 
All right, you're absolutely fine, missus, and I'm so glad you could validate. Steve Mack, that makes a lot of sense to me. I have had readings recently and my grand's always come through. It's just nice hearing more confirmation. Thank you. Steve, start concentrating on yourself. That's what I feel like saying. You need to work on you a little bit. You'll feel more content in yourself. I feel there's a lot of anxiety around you, but it's all up here. All right, so stop worrying. Let it go. All right. Thanks, Steve. Diane Brown, I really need positive energy right now. Any reading would be amazing. Diane, come on, pull your socks up. You're absolutely fine. It's all about your state of mind. I know there's a lot of situations going on round about you, but I want to say, stay present, stay in right now. You're too much of the yes person. You need to say no more. All right, Diane. All right. So I'm going to ask... Again, this is your last chance to like and share the video for the chance to win the online reading. Can I ask admin to message me in the next... We'll go for three minutes and if you put a comment underneath to say no more sharing and then just if you drop me a wee message to tell me who the winner is um, through WhatsApp. Cheers, guys. The admin, honestly, they deal with everything. I've got the easy job. I don't feel like I've got the easy job, but I've got the easy job. They have to do everything else. A lot of you are asking for private readings. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm, I'm fully booked at the moment. I will put more online availability up for online readings, but it won't be this week. I'm back to work on Thursday. And then that will be me to Monday. I'll probably do a live video on Sunday. That's a definite. I'll do it on Sunday. You've got my word on that. Katie McDade. I've never lost anyone close. Is there any guidance for me? Yeah, Katie. That's... What I feel like saying to you is you're in quite a positive place, but again, like everyone else, you're waiting on a curveball. It's not coming. I want to see that there's a man round about you just now that, oh, he's giving you a run for your money. He challenges you a bit. It's good though. It's healthy. All right. Um, take away some of the insecurity. All right, Katie. I hope you can relate to that. Who else? Boys are all lovely with your hearts and comments. Nice to hear your positivity tonight. Off to watch first dates. Bye, Emma Lawless. <laughs> Listen, I'm not far behind you. <coughs> right, I'm going to pick some one more person and then we'll stop liking and sharing the video from now, if that's okay, and I'll get admin to send me over a winner and I'll pick one more person for a quick reading. Who are we going to go to? Hi, Sandra. Oh, hey, Sandra, missing you. <laughs> I'll be back to work on Thursday. Ashley Finnegan. Hi, Christy, thanks for that. Just to validate, we were just talking about a change in car five minutes ago. I get it about the hair as well. I'm considering a career change, but don't know if it's a good idea. It's a brilliant idea, Ashley. You're picking your job for life when you do your career change, all right. Thanks, Ashley. And we'll just do one more reading for everyone. Here we go. Has admin been on yet? Admin, are you on the page, guys? Can one of you message me? Right, I've got a winner. That's fine, she's messaged now. Right, okay. <coughs> right, I'm just write that down. And I'm going to do one more comment. So don't like and share it anymore, guys, because that's the competition. We've picked a winner now. Heather Graham. Hope you had an amazing holiday. Would love a reading, liked and shared. Heather, I feel like saying to you... There's a man in spirit and it's about his chest. Um, I don't know if he passed through his chest, just bring, bring your comment. But there's also someone asthmatic round about you that's not looking after their shell or they're not looking after their chest properly. And I want to say that you're doing too much and you need to slow down a bit. You're burning the candle at both ends. I have got a cheek to talk, but start slowing down and start listening to spirit more. I hope that makes sense, Heather, all right? Okay, okay. Right, guys, the winner of the competition tonight is Jackie Wine. Now, Jackie, can you message your page? Admin are going to come back to you. Um, and we'll arrange the reading. It'll be admin that come back to you tonight. We'll arrange the reading between tomorrow and the next day. But if you drop us a wee message, all right, congratulations. Guys, thanks all for watching. I know it's been a bit quick tonight. Um, but I'm absolutely shattered. I've done 10 readings today. I just want to say a big thanks actually to my clients today. They were hospitality. It's always amazing. Um, to Carol and also to Margaret as well. I'm not sure if they're watching or not. But just thank you very, very much for all your hospitality. I will do another... Oh, hi, Jackie. You've came on. Yes, that's you. 
<laughs> thanks very much for sharing, Jackie. And again, thanks to everybody for liking and being so active on the page. You've been sending a lot of mails asking when we're going live. I promise you, all the views are going down now, the competition is done. Um, I promise you, I'm trying to get through you all. Peter Morgan, hello, you wee legend. Right back at you, Peter. <laughs> I'm not going to do that. <laughs> um, <coughs> thanks again, everybody, for everything in the page. On Sunday, we'll go live again, but I'll also put some updates if I have any availability before then. Take care and night-night, all right? See ya, bye!